Alright, we'll have another battle, then we'll go and siege his capital, then we should be good to go. Yeah, I think a siege on his capital will uh, be done for him then. He's not going to come back from that. Oh, we're actually at 97% now. So one one more battle will uh, we'll put paid to his attempts at uh, survival. Oh, will you stop running away though? That's really rather irritating. Uh, I know we've won, but I do want to kill your army. So. I wonder, did I kill any of his, um, what's it called, his champions? I captured a couple. Hey, that last battle was totally worth it. Alright, so we'll enforce peace. And we'll disband the army. And we're negative 64 ducats. But, I believe we've got some prisoners who we can sell. Can't demand conversion on any of them. I can demand conversion on you. You are just a rando, though. From House Eroticos. Huh. I mean, to ransom you is ten ducats. I would rather make a Hellenic fella. And you know what? We'll recruit him as well. He's got fairly decent stats. Uh, and then Theodorus Merimblankandukus. He's got the county of Abydos as a claim. Where is Abydos? That's right there. Mm, I don't think I need you. How much are you to sell? Ten ducats? Well, demand conversion anyway. Send you off on your way. These ones, 30 ducats. And 30 ducats will put paid to most of my debt. My spam master has come to me with grave news. It's my sister, and she's plotting against my concubine. The bitch. The file fiend. Alright, but then again... That's irrelevant, because we've just grown, you know, hellas, which is great. You keep having problems. What is your problem? Liberty War. And surely you've won by now. Alright, I need to get my son married, and, uh... Well, looking at that, intelligent lady seems really quite nice. I like the idea of marrying someone this intelligent. She's also just patient and diligent. Just like the perfect wife. It's, it's awesome. I will marry... Oh, and we gain prestige as well. Absolutely glorious. So we'll do that. Guardian from Pompeius Galerius. He is... 15. Uh, maybe a little bit too late to get him a... A decent education. But we'll try with Cecilius. And then also Publia Caesar can marry. She's got kids? No, she doesn't. Alright, well, we'll get you a matrilineal marriage uh, to my champion as a reward for him being so amazing, I think. Maybe. Alright, lovely. We're out of debt. We've gained some land. Um, Galerius has grown up. Decent, tra uh, decent education, actually. And we'll have you marry... Somebody else. Like this lady right here. Lovely. Eventually, when she comes of age, you'll marry her. Right, as for our next conquest... Um, we can't attack you anymore. It's going to be against you, isn't it? If you count Michael's claims on all of your shit. I mean... While I've got the mercenaries, may as well use them. Uh, if I go... I'm going to have to go onto the water regardless of what I do. So fine. We're just going to immediately try and land on Naxos. Oh, that will put us back into debt. How are you doing for money? 153 gold. Okay. My culture is now in the high medieval era. Right now, we're trying to get the armillary sphere for naval speed, which is, let's be honest, kind of irrelevant. Uh, so we're going to immediately switch over to trebuchets. 
because obviously everyone loves a good trebuchet. Mostly because they're fucking delightful. Bit of debt, never hurt anyone, it's alright. So Hellas will grow even further. And I will also try and revoke Euboea uh, after this, so that I have all of the county of Athens. And, uh, you know, this guy can have all of the Aegean Islands. It's fine by me. Uh, let's go here and we'll go and siege Abydos. And that more than likely will be enough, hopefully. We're spending even more money. Somebody's trying to murder Gordiana, but she's so, so close to being, you know, having babies. Leave her have the babies, please. Uh, my sister has given birth to Crassus Sextus Caesar. Uh, I'm loving my naming convention in this run. It's, it actually brings me so much joy. Lambert is in more debt than the USA? Uh, no. <laughs> not, not quite. A bit of debt never hurt anyone. You are truly embraced the Greek way of thinking. But alas, I am not Greek. I'm Roman. <laughs> a new translation. More than anything, my quest to be a learned man is teaching me how much I do not yet know. What's more, there must be so much knowledge that is lost to the ages as books fall apart or languages are forgotten. Maybe I should contribute by making a new translation of one of the classic works. So, we'll translate Aristotle's Physica into Latin. Uh, yeah. Translate that book. Why not? The naming convention is awesome. I'm glad you like it. It is so easy as well. It's just like, copy this, paste it here. And it fits so well. Um, so we can improve the translation quality by taking a bit of critical stress. Uh, yeah, let's take a bit of critical stress. That's fine. And we'll try and get athletic. Oh, not even try. We will just get athletic. That's fucking perfect because athletic is such a good trait. And yeah, we'll just be sweaty for a whole year. Let's go. Sweat is just, you know, it's it's good for you. Probably, maybe. Anyway, let's go siege Lesvos. He's going to take back Naxos, unfortunately. I can't get over there in time. But that's fine. Spending prestige... Yeah, that's fine. That's okay. It'll do. It'll do the trick. Also, if you go for Abydos now, I'll be able to go and hit you. So, it's gonna be fine. We'll, we'll finish this siege, and then we'll go and murder his face. So. 95% chance the translation quality will improve significantly. Uh, yeah. And 150 prestige. Beautiful. All right, and we'll go and hit your army. There's 100%. Enforce the demands. A ton. So now Hellas owns a significant amount of land. And we will hold another mystical communion to get another 300 lifestyle experience and more friendships. Absolutely amazing. Unlock that one. We'll see, we've got one prisoner worth 10 ducats. She's from House Ducas. That is the current reigning emperors. Oh no, the Komnenoi are back in charge. All right, well, the Ducasies, uh, I guess you can just be sold then. We're not out of debt, but we did just gain a ton of land, so every little helps. And what else we will do? What we could do, actually, is wait until we are uh, close to death and then revoke territory. Um, so that this character, yeah, he's going to be hated as fuck. Uh, but his, his 
a successor won't be hated nearly as much. Yeah, that's nice. And another learning perk. Fuck yes. Uh, let's let's focus on reading, and we'll get some. We'll wash our hands. You know, in these COVID times, it's something we always must forget. Oh, uh, not forget. The opposite of that. Remember. Sweat is weakness leaving the body. Sure, we'll go with that. Hello there, Constantine. How you doing? Um, all right. Speaking of. Uh, you know, weakness leaving the body. I just got a little bit of weakness in the body. 25 ducats for a, um, for a, what's called, a physician in bed, so that's fine. And it worked, so we're no longer quite as sick. Lovely. I don't really want Abydos. It's, uh, land across the sea is, is a worry. It is, it is a weak point. But, you know, it's fine. We'll, we'll deal with it. We'll cope. So this is the Aegean Islands. You've got a little bit of it, so I guess I could attack Kiraboy Toy, or whatever your name is, um, and take over the rest of the islands. Take a Dejure County. We've got two. We've also got Rhodes. Let's start off with that one. And we'll just declare war. This is fine. This is okay. Let's go for Chios. Hopefully he doesn't call in some allies. If he doesn't, we've already got this. Like We've got enough men. Won't you get the opinion of predecessor negative? Yes, but that goes away relatively quickly. Uh, we've got lower county control. It's just a peasant rabble. That's, that's fine. That's not, not an issue. Uh, 100% chance that I win on my own. No, 94% chance I win on my own. That's fine. I saved a life today. And I get another learning perk. Uh, we'll go for mental resilience. And you are going to go for roads. Which unfortunately means I need to go back on the water, which I hate, but it's fine. Atolia is fighting against the tyranny of Douge Michael. Douge Michael. Okay, so it's Naxos that's fighting against you. Fair enough. Alright. May I ask how you survived the early game as start in Hellenist, or did you start in the later date? I started in 1066, and I started as the, the Duke of Athens, and one of the first things we did was change our feudal contract to protect ourselves from title revocation. Uh, we're no longer the Spymaster, which is fine, I didn't really want to be anyway. Mm, let's just say fairness. He lost 15 opinion of me. Damn it. You want a white piece? Um, did you get allies or something? No, you're, you're just weak. Why would I white piece you? Go away. These patrol people can marry. That's fine. We've sieged Rhodes. I guess now we need to go back on the water and siege... We'll go and siege Telemessos. Or we could go and attack your army. That would work too. Although we also have a peasants problem. Uh, apparently the peasants immediately lost, which is good for me. And I'm going to have a battle with my enemy, helping me out. There, lovely stuff. All right, one one siege and we should be good to go. I was lucky with the peasants that they, I guess, ro uh, risen up on a group of people who didn't like them. There's the hundred percent there, and we get Chios to spend the army. And now we're seventy ducats in debt. We've got four prisoners. There's fifty right there. 
Um, you can be Hellenic. You can be Hellenic. And you can give me 50 ducats. So that war was actually profitable for us. Fantastic stuff. Wouldn't someone with a hook, uh, wouldn't someone need a hook for that? Or is there some other way I'm missing? Oh, to get ourselves title revocation protection. Um, if you want to modify your feudal contract uh, to get you something that you want, like title revocation, you have to give, the, give something up in return. So we gave up forced partition. And then later on, we did another uh, contract negotiation where I got religious rights protection in favor, uh, sorry, in return for higher feudal levies. In the future, I hope to get some hooks on the emperor so that I can lower this with a hook rather than lowering it for giving up something somewhere else. So, all right, we're doing good. We're doing good. Uh, we have another person of my dynasty. He's going to be called Magnus Caecilius. What a powerful name. Does it also protect you if you start as a count? Uh, it protects you from your duke? I have no idea if that will continue on when you become a duke yourself. I have not done that, so I would have to look. Alright, so at some point we'll attack you for roads, but not quite yet. Somebody is trying to fabricate a hook on Martius. I don't really care. But yeah, we are becoming quite strong. 2,000 men now is not very comparable, uh, but, you know, it's getting there. And there is a faction to install Cosmos on the throne. If I join that, I think I will get a... A hook on the new emperor but I would like this lower crown authority one first so I'm gonna join that one a 78% only hopefully that's gonna become stronger at the moment it is myself Hellas we've also got Cappadocia we've got Ephesus we've got Epirus we've got um, the prince who leads Zagorja, and we've got Cephalonia, so not exactly the strongest ones. We'd want someone like uh, Anatolikon, Thracesian, uh, Moesia, uh, Bulgaria, something like that would be good. Uh, easier to convert Thessalia. Yes, please. Uh, let's try and actually convert Thessalia now. We're actually doing relatively well on the conversion. Hellenic is spreading quite nicely. All of Achaia um, is, is already the correct religion and culture. It's fantastic. A uh, few contracts are inherited by your new liege under most circumstances, in my opinion, experience. I, if I dig someone out from under someone they don't have a new contract, I don't know for sure if they usurp the duke on their own. Okay. Uh, is an account technically the vassal of an emperor in the end of the day? So couldn't you modify the feudal contract with the emperor instead of, or is it hierarchy? Um, well, for instance, we've got the Duke of Achaia is beneath me. Beneath him... Actually, do you even have any vessels? You've taken all this land for yourself. That's awesome. Uh, I mean, you've got this baron here. I can't change his feudal contract. Uh, Duke of Thessaly has this count under him. And I cannot change their contract. So... It seems like a no right now. You are Hellenic Greek. Good. That's fine. And yeah, when we are about to die, I'm going to revoke uh, Euboea. Yeah, but things are looking good for me so far. Uh, expanding as a kingdom, you can only attack other kingdoms now. Uh, not necessarily. You can attack people smaller. In my dealings with Princeps Leontus Crassus, I may have accidentally made certain promises of exemptions from his obligations. Fuel tax is reduced, uh, or a hook. Uh, Leontius Crassus is my player heir, is he not? Oh no, he's Thessaly. Uh, or I could use my weak hook on him to not have that happen. Hey, someone's trying to kill me again. That's just delightful. get you married to uh, Miss Helena. Good enough. 
we will go on a mystical communion and we will grab ourselves an iron constitution. Something went wrong. I did gain the lifestyle experience. I also gained divine guidance, but I also became ill. So, you know, you win some, you lose some. It's all right. I can change Douge Michael's contract. True. I'll tell you what I could do. 15 years. You know what? I'm going to cancel this to get myself a claim on Uboya. Uh, once I've got the claim on Uboya, then I will start uh, converting Thessaly again. The Ecumenical Patriarch becomes my rival. Uh, no, I don't think that's wise. I do not think that's wise at all. Yeah, if I can get a claim on Euboya, then it won't be tyrannical to revoke it from him. And because I have a hook on him, I will be able to get him to not go to war with me for it. So, you know, we'll be okay. I'm no longer ill. Fantastic news. Uh, I am now the Chancellor, so I guess that's a big boost to my prestige gain. Um, Liege's Chancellor plus three. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. Um, are you any good at anything else? You're good at martial stuff, but you're there as a marshal. I guess you're going to have to take that spot then. And you're not very good at it. Uh, you can convert. You can convert Nexos. Eight years to convert culture, not bad. You can help the control in Corinthos. Um, designate a guardian for Herculius Alexander, my wife. Felix Maximilian can marry, and will marry you off to. Um, I don't know. I guess Tour Yemaic. I also lawfully imprison you because you are an attempted murderer. Okay then. Lutverius, uh, my brother in law. God damn it. Is is being rude. So we're gonna actually try and imprison you. I can't because uh, he's my ally. Well, I guess not then. Alliance formed with Can Bartos of Cicerino, and you're in prison. And we're no longer Chancellor, so we're down again to three point six. Just just make up your mind, my dude. Make up your mind. I guess we'll make. Uh, you're no good at this job, but you're pretty good at that job. So that's only four years to convert. We could actually swap you out for you, my sister, because you're really good at that job. Now it's only three years to get my uh, to get myself a claim. That works out really nicely. That will work out really nicely. Uh, you're still led by... Actually, no, we can attack you right now. Alright. New name. Ciciaris Helvia Caesar. Perfect. Alright, we want to go for the County of Rhodes now. So, declare war for the County of Rhodos. The amount of power on each side is kind of comparable, which is slightly worrying. No, you've got 3,000 men now, so I think I might need to call myself an ally or three. Not sure how much of these guys are going to help me, but hopefully that wasn't prestige wasted. So having a look at this now, my allies are up here, up here, and up here. How terribly useful. Yes, yes. All right, let's go and siege Optimatoi. Yeah, 
Yeah, he's just landed 2,500 men on roads. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait on that. I am not going to attack roads directly just yet. He can he can sit there. Gaius Paulus Caesar. What a strong name that is. You're going onto the water. That's fine. Do I see any movement from my allies? 300 men. 300 men and, and 400 men are coming south. Just, I mean, it's delightful and it's perfect and all that. Too bad you cannot rename your men at arms to like Hestai and Triarii. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. It would be all right, wouldn't it? It's a shame there's no um, specific Roman, um, very, very specific to the Roman culture uh, troops. Because there's a few cultures that get, you know, unique men-at-arms units. Um, I would like the Romans to have one. Oh my god, 3,000 fuckers just sitting on it. What I'm probably going to do is siege their capital, retreat from it, and see if that will force them to abandon roads to come and, you know, deal with the, the siege. 